everyone my name is Ryan Ryan wish you a good day today the Ryan would like to you for visiting my channel here picnic one now for seven here is the official new photos. One Rays versus Tigers game today. New time and why it was rescheduled. The Tampa Bay Rays versus Detroit Tigers game, scheduled for Tuesday, September 24th, has been rescheduled to an earlier start time of 2 p.m. ET, originally set for 1:10 p.m. This change was made due to concerns about potential inclement weather later in the evening, as communicated by the Tigers on their social media. Two. Who won the Bengals game? Final score against the Commanders The Cincinnati Bengals have struggled in the 2024 NFL season, currently rank 18th out of 32 teams. They lost their first two games. Falling to the New England Patriots, 10-16, and the Kansas City Chiefs, 25-26. As they head into Week 4, they are set to play an NFC South opponent. In their most recent game on September 23rd, they faced the Washington Commanders with quarterback Joe Burrow leading the team with 324 passing yards, running back Chase Brown contributing 62 rushing yards, and wide receiver Jamar Chase adding 118 receiving yards. 3. Brett Favre has Parkinson's disease. Learn about the former NFL players Heedolf Brett Favre announced in September 2024 that he has been diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. Revealing this during a statement before Congress while discussing temporary assistance for needy families. The former NFL star. Celebrated for his 20-year career and induction into the Football Hall of Fame, has raised concerns among fans regarding his health. 4. NFL Power Rankings for Week 3 Updates on the Season Week 3 of the NFL concluded on September 23, 2024, with Monday Night Football, setting the stage for Week 4, which starts on September 26 with a matchup between the Dallas Cowboys and New York Giants. Five teams remain undefeated, the Seattle Seahawks, Kansas City Chiefs, Buffalo Bills, Pittsburgh Steelers and Minnesota Vikings all at 3-0. In the current team rankings by ESPN, the Pittsburgh Steelers lead the AFC North with a 3-0 record, ranked 12th overall. The Cleveland Browns and Baltimore Ravens are tied for second in the division, both with 1-2 records and ranked 22nd. 5. Jaden Daniels, 5 things about the Washington Commanders rookie Jaden Daniels. A rookie quarterback for the Washington Commanders recently gained attention after leading the team to a 38-33 victory over the Cincinnati Bengals in a Monday night football game. Daniels, who started his NFL career in 2024, has helped the Commanders win two of their first three games this season. His composure on the field has impressed his teammates, including Nick Allegretti. Who praised his ability to stay calm under pressure? Six NFL standings 2024. Which team is undefeated in Week Three? The NFL's third week of the 2024 season has concluded, showcasing various team performances. The week kicked off with the New York Jets defeating the New England Patriots highlighted by Aaron Rodgers' impressive 281 passing yards. A close match between the Kansas City Chiefs and Atlanta Falcons also added to the excitement. While some teams experienced mixed results, five teams remain undefeated, the Pittsburgh Steelers. 
Minnesota Vikings, Buffalo Bills, Kansas City Chiefs, and Seattle Seahawks. Two games are still set to conclude Week 3 on September 23rd. 7. Why was Bryce Young benched? Update after Andy Dalton was chosen Carolina Panthers quarterback Bryce Young was benched by coach Dave Canales and replaced by Andy Dalton, marking the first time in years that a number. One overall draft pick was benched for non-injury reasons. Coach Canales stated that the decision was ultimately his. Made after discussions with general manager Dan Morgan and executive vice president Brant Tillis. He emphasized that his primary responsibility is to help the Panthers win. And he believed this move would provide the best chance for success. 8. Who is Tyler Huntley? Five things about the new Dolphins quarterback after a loss to the Buffalo Bills and with quarterback Tua Tungavailoa out due to a concussion. The Miami Dolphins are seeking a reliable backup to lead the team. They plan to start Skylar Thompson in their upcoming game against the Seattle Seahawks but have signed Tyler Huntley from the Baltimore Ravens practice squad as a second backup. Huntley, 26, will provide additional support in case Thompson is injured. 9. Isaiah Pacheco Injury Update What happened to the Chiefs running back? Kansas City Chiefs running back Isaiah Pacheco suffered an injury during the NFL game against the Cincinnati Bengals on September 15, leaving the stadium on crutches. Despite his injury, the Chiefs secured a narrow victory, winning 26-25. Pacheco had accumulated 135 yards over the first two weeks of the season and played a key role in the team's offense. He injured his right ankle during a tackle on the final possession, and reports indicate he may have fractured his fibula. Further tests are expected to confirm the extent of his injury. 10. Tua Tungavailoa Update What's next for the Dolphins QB after his concussion? Tua Tungavailoa experienced another serious concussion during a game on Thursday night after colliding with Bills safety Damar Hamlin. The incident occurred late in the third quarter, and Tunga Vailoa needed assistance to leave the field. Although he was reportedly in good spirits post-game, his teammates and coaches were visibly concerned. As this marks his third diagnosed concussion in two years, Tunga Vailoa is under a four-year, $212.4 million contract extension with the Dolphins. But coach Mike McDaniel has not given any immediate updates on his condition.